to the fourth edition of the Wanton Cup in Le Havre, uh, that the Société des Regates du Havre is uh, um, particularly honored to organize. Uh, I would like to thank the Cirque de la Voile de Paris uh, to have initiated this comeback in France and the fast 40 plus class to have accepted to cross the channel for this uh, jubilee. Uh, this year is the 120th uh, anniversary of the first regatta. Awesome. The fleet is really tight and um, it was just like close racing, super fast, super fun, so I enjoyed it. It was an awesome team and a really good day. Yeah, I think it's quite nice being in the half at the home of the One Ton Cup. Um, you know, it wasn't a long trip over here and it's a, these away events are kind of nice for the class because everyone um, socialised a bit more and it's a little, little mini holiday um, and the other racing has been really well run, it's a good place to be so um, yeah we're sort of behind these close far away races. Accelerating, fun and wet, and extremely wet. Uh, and I think as the day progresses, the, the, the wash just becomes more and more, the, the waves are getting chopper and choppier, but so much fun. Oh, it's been amazing. It's like, I mean, utterly glorious weather, like sun shining, 22 uh, knots at times, uh, and, you know, really good bleak. A downwind start, uh, and it, it, it was a downwind start on port, which made it very uh, difficult, uh, and position on the line was absolutely key. We decided to come in on starboard, uh, which I think caused a few uh, nervous moments for one or two of our competitors uh, at the top of the line. So came in on starboard and then jibed onto port just before the gun went and, and that put us on top of the fleet and enabled us to, uh, to reach down and get in a good position by the bottom, uh, by the bottom mark. Because of the close racing, um, there's always different targets you can go for within the class. Even if you're right at the back, you can pick up, you can pick, identify the boats that you want to go for and try and pick them off. You don't have to be up the front to be um, have fun in this class. There's just always so many opportunities for close racing all the way through the fleet, and it's been great fun at every level. today summed up the whole fleet really I mean uh, Elvis won the first race and was last in the second race and we were second last in the first race and won the second race so you know you can be in the penthouse or the outhouse pretty easy in this fleet 
Oh, it was great fun. We didn't. We were yeah, pretty nervous coming in. Never sailed in the class before, and got really good sailors. And uh, but first day, glamour day, sunny, windy. Second place, lulled into a full sense of security, and then a steep learning curve off the back of that. <laughs> so, but it's been brilliant. Everyone's been really welcoming, and I've had a great lot of fun and learnt along the way. I think that it was difficult last year as well and I think this this year in this regatta I think the whole fleet just came together everyone were more competitive and uh, you know we've had to fight hard for it so um, it's, we knew we had to um, do all everything that we usually do and uh, well and and uh, but it was it was good competition but it is a team sport and it's also important that everyone knows where the job is and that everyone else allows everyone else to do their job and not start shouting at each other. So uh, I think that's the key and, and then uh, clarity, also good communication is important. But what we've been very pleased with is that we have quite a few young sailors on board. And so last year was a bit of a learning curve for some, some of them to, to learn to sail together and to sail with our boat and, and, and this type of racing. And I think now this year we, we're seeing the benefits of, 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 of that um, investment of time from them. So it's been fantastic. Third place overall, Tony Dickin, Jubilee. Second place, Girls on Film, Peter Morton. Yes. Second year in succession, Ron, really well sailed series, Ron, Nicholas Zenstrom and the team. Up, please. 